welcome back to my channel if you're new to the channel click the subscribe button if you're not new welcome back to another video today's video we are here with jt and jeezy okay official video now if you haven't heard okay the original okay which is um jt song um it does give like a jeezy slash gucci main um combination with the beat the flow the vibe everything so people been telling her like jeezy jeezy gucci gucci and she was like it was neither and i'm just like jc girl she got jeezy on okay like that was just to seal it all off because we was just telling you to give him the recognition but the fact you put him on the song, yes, it's a vibe. And, you know, people mess with Mr. Snowman, so don't get it messed up. And people mess with JT. And I feel like when people seen her pop out with Jeezy, people was like, okay, JT is up there now. Because she's with Jeezy. Like, it's just, it's certified, you know what I'm saying? And then, okay, is just a good record anyway. Like, I think okay is a great record. Um, She dropped the original. She has the extended version. She has chopped version. It's different versions of OK. So OK is just OK. Like, yeah. But we about to get into the video. I want everybody to like, comment, and subscribe. Let's go ahead and jump right into the thing. What my bad bitch I'm pretty than a motherfucker. Hoss, we looking OK. Yeah. She's she fucking with me. Is this bitch OK? He said he ain't fucking around. I let him fuck me. Like, OK, he's Okay. I'm looking at him like, okay. Oh, oh, I hear Jeezy. Yeah. <laughs> I hear Jeezy. I love JT's looks, though. I feel like people be saying JT look ugly, but JT be dripped. I ain't gonna lie. JT don't look like everybody else. JT is JT. You know what I'm saying? I feel like people be hating on JT because JT don't look like everybody else. And her style's very weird but she embraces that weird and it looks so good on her like i don't know i i like the way jt dressed for jt like it's it's, it's jt jt on the track like <laughs> GC popping out. He just said I had to get divorced to get back to my roots. <laughs> like people was talking about, he was Asian for a couple years and came back black. I don't know. Uh, I wouldn't say all that, but GC been, you know, I guess one of the legends or one of the like the best like artists in the rap game. He's been like stamp. He's called Snowman for a reason. You know what I'm saying? And just to see him come back on a track like this that definitely gives like a Jeezy vibe, it's amazing. Especially with the female rapper, JT. Vibes going well. And, you know, he just recently got divorced. So, I guess it's just like, man, it's time for me to get back to what I was doing. You know what I'm saying? I put my career on pause for... I don't even know if he put his career on pause or was it just like he wasn't making as much like promotional like or music as being in a relationship and being in a marriage i don't know who knows because she was on television i think isn't she the girl to be on the like the morning show i don't know but yeah they divorced and he's back and he said he's single as a dollar bill a dollar bill <laughs> Yes, I ain't gonna lie. He kind of made okay level up. I ain't gonna lie. With Jeezy stamped on this, it definitely. I ain't gonna lie. JT might get back on the Billboard with okay again because the way she, in a way that she is, re like not. I won't. I don't want to say recycle, but the way she's like. You know, she's using OK to her advantage. Like, she ain't dropping no new music because she already said City Girl Cinderella. City, City, Cinderella. City Girl, 
So I guess she don't want to drop no more singles, but um, she's really she's doing really good using OK and pushing OK. You know what I'm saying? Jeezy slid, bruh. All bars. I've never I heard nothing but bars. You know what I'm saying? Jeezy slid. JT, I know you don't got a new verse, babe. You wrote another one for Jeezy? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Told you. Who y'all think gonna be the princess of rap? You know, like nobody's gonna take Nikki's spot. Nikki is the queen of rap. So who do you really think gonna be the princess of rap? Y'all think JT gonna do it? I think JT got the skills. I feel like JT got the momentum. JT got it. I ain't gonna lie. JT might have it. That's who I got. <laughs> I've been killing every summer. I wish JT had another verse, low key, but she got so many versions. Yes, this was great. Ten tens, JT. Ten tens. I'm gonna say ten tens, and I'm gonna tell y'all why I say ten ten. Ten tens to JT because not only did you drop three fire singles back to back to back, and not only that, but you have different versions of this song out. Okay, she's pushing. Okay, you know what I'm saying? Pushing. Okay, then giving the people what they want. You know what I'm saying? You got. People are telling you to sound like a Jeezy type, Gucci type beat. What she do? She go get Jeezy. And what that does solidifies the song. You know what I'm saying? It makes the song strong. And he slid. I ain't gonna lie. Jeezy's verse gave me like, he, you know what he, he remind? oh, sorry, y'all. Y'all, he reminded me of, of when 50 came on Beat Beat for Nicki. But it was, it was just two, two different vibes, but that same bond I feel like was there. Like it just felt so genuine. But shout out to JT, shout out to Jeezy. Tell me what y'all thought about his verse in the comments down below. I want everybody to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll be back with a video. Grr, bow!